Case 38, Animal Control. Oh, sorry. Hey, Joe, uh, I can tell you, Joe, hey, that, that number we're saying, that's what all those provisions are vacant that you're talking about, right? Yes. That's correct. Page 39, uh, Emergency Management. Page 40, med, uh, Emergency Medical Services and Coordinate. And we're uh, obligated on the EMS? Um, you do not have a contract currently. Um, there are negotiations in process for a contract. Uh, I do not anticipate there being um, a, a financial uh, obstacle to complete that. It's just primarily a time issue. But it will require some discussion between the uh, hospital and the uh, county commissioners to resolve that. I'm sure you probably will have some concern over uh, the fact that there is not rolling stock added to this year's budget. So appropriations will basically be maintenance and it's just for the actual operations and subsidizes the operations of the EMS service. And I think I mentioned to y'all before the EMS services based on two items, one transports and two on emergency responses. Uh, transportation of uh, patients to higher levels of care uh, are generally more profitable than the uh, emergency responses. Um, and hospitals or EMS providers are all struggling to deal with the funding now associated with uh, the federal government reimbursement. Keep in mind, too, that you also have emergency calls. They go, and they don't transport anybody. So you have cost involved there, but you don't have the cost that it does Joe, could you get a, um, I guess, just a, a estimate of what it would take to have an uh, ambulance and get to the North Amos area that we talking about? I had a conversation with the uh, hospital administrator concerning the location of a facility uh, in the Bemis area. Um, the discussion centered around the actual Bemis fire station and uh, whether or not that could be funded. Uh, I think the hospital is interested in us discussing that in the coming year. The numbers on the calls uh, are increasing in that area. Um, and of course, we get a report uh, on a periodic basis on the A, the number of calls, and B, just as I showed you on the, the fire response. call, the response time. And if that response time uh, starts increasing, then um, that, that's a major so, yes, to answer your question, we will. He said he was mainly concerned about the time it takes to get uphill and against the beam is traffic during the daytime. Right. That, that concerned the most. Where did they support beam is from now? From the hospital? From the hospital. Mm -hmm. And it, it, he says it's, well, it's not coming back to the hospital that hurts it's going. Uh, it tends to hurt the most. Page 41. Public Works Administration. Joe, real quick on EMS, does it, does it make a difference to the hospital if it's budgeted under appropriations versus rolling stock? Six and one half dozen the other? They get a check either way. Okay, that's kind of what I thought. Okay. 